Once upon a time, in a cozy house, lived a girl named Attica. Attica had two siblings, Max and Mia. Unfortunately, Max and Mia were not very nice to Attica. They would tease her and play mean tricks on her every day. Atticus felt sad and lonely because of their cruel behavior. Max and Mia were very different from Attica. They would laugh when their mother scolded Attica, and they never shared anything with her. Instead of helping her, they would give her extra chores to do. It seemed like they enjoyed being mean. Attica's mother, on the other hand, criticized Attica's every move and find fault in her smallest actions. No matter how hard Attica tried, her mother's words cut like daggers, leaving scars on her spirit. She used to treat her other children with love and care, but with her, it was like she is her stepchild. Every day she used to do all work of her house, but her mother never appreciated her. One stormy day, Attica's mother brought home some delicious sweets. Attica's couldn't resist and ate a few. When the stepmother saw this, she got really angry. She shouted at Attica and told her to leave the house right away. Poor Attica was sad and confused, but she packed her things and left. Walking in the storm, she felt sad but determined. She wasn't going to let their cruelty break her spirit. She believed that somewhere, her kindness would find a place to belong. Suddenly, she remembered her friend's house was nearby. She decided to go there. Attica's friend was very kind and welcoming. When she heard what happened, she hugged Attica and told her she could stay as long as she wanted. Attica felt loved and safe. With time, Attica's mother realized her mistake. She felt bad for being so mean to Attica over some sweets. She decided to visit Attica and apologize. Attica forgave her mother and decided to go back home. Attica's life became better after that. Her mother started treating her better. Her siblings also apologized to her and started sharing everything with her and also help her in chores. They all lived happily and with laughter, knowing that being kind to each other was the sweetest thing of all.